Now, the eyes of the world are focusing on Rio as the countdown to the 2016 Olympics enters its final stage. Normally, we'd all be focusing on the sport right now, but worries over the Zika virus, finances and crime are still grabbing most of the headlines. Let's get a sense of the pre-games atmosphere in Rio with our Shin Semin, who joins us live from Brazil. Semin. Mark, the build-up to this Olympic Games has been beset by a number of issues from local political scandal, the Zika outbreak, to Russian doping, all causing unwanted distractions. But with this sporting extravaganza getting underway on Friday local time, it looks like some of those problems will be forgotten, at least for a couple of weeks, as the people from all around the world are here to be part of the world's quadrennial sporting event. Rio, the city of Samba, one of the most famous tourist destinations in the world for its postcard perfect views, is in full-on preparation mode as the first South American city to host the Summer Olympics. Counting down to the big opening ceremony, Rio hasn't seen this many tourists in years, maybe ever. Not at all. No, you always got to be positive in life. And things always happen for the better, so I don't even worry. Despite the excitement, Rio and Brazil in general still face a mountain of problems. Political instability, violent crime and Zika are the main concerns among visitors from overseas and even residents of the city. Yeah, we have the security increasing a lot at the time because we are worried that the violence will increase now because of the other people that are coming here right now. So the security will increase a lot. We have the armies, we have more police here just because of the events. The Brazilian government is taking extra security precautions, especially in light of the rising number of terror attacks around the world. Brazil's defense ministry says 85,000 military and police officers have been drafted in for the Olympics, the country's largest deployment ever. The organizers hope all these problems will melt away when sporting stars from all four corners of the world march through the doors of Maracana Stadium for opening ceremony. Now that gets underway on Friday, 8 p.m. local time. So that means it'll be 8 a.m. Saturday for viewers in Korea. Make sure to tune in because it'll be a lot of fun. Mark.